Hey guys, for this week's video, I want to do something I had never done before. So a little backstory is my dad is a geologist and unfortunately I did not follow him in that same field of dreams. Uh, I don't really, I can't recognize that many rocks off the top of my head and I want to know what it's like to be my dad. So I went to the store and got this Smithsonian rock and gym dig kit because I'm sure that's exactly how it was for my dad when he was out in the field. You do have to follow certain safety precautions. If you're out in the field and it's really hot, be sure to drink lots of fluids. So to dress like a geologist, you have to look the part. Our laundry got mixed up, so I found a pair of my dad's old pants. They're actual geologist jeans. Looking like a geologist. Mm, dead ass though. So now that we look the part, it is time to go into the field. We have goggles! These are so uncomfortable, what the fuck? Okay, on a scale of like, one to fuck, these glasses are fuck. Warning, this is a toy does not provide protection. Mallet, dowel, magnifying glass. I see you! This is exactly like a geologist. Ugh. We now have our work surface set up. Uh, I mean, it's fucking professional, what are you talking about? It says the Smithsonian Institute. So that's where I'm gonna fucking break the shit out of it. Safety first, remember? So let's find 11 stones. Okay, sippy sippy. I'm watching too much graveyard, girl. I love her. Hi, Sirius. Okay. Remember, we are looking for 11 stones. I don't even know how to start this. This is dope! Making a fucking mess. Okay, so we had to make some readjustments to the camera angles and stuff so you could see better. I feel like I'm on Jurassic Park. This is what they did, right? And in case you didn't know, my alcohol is setting in, so that's even great. That's just great. So far, we are just making a big fucking mess. I am sweating. I don't know if it's these lights or like hammering or what. Thank you, such good help. Like a giant crack. <gasps> Whoa, look at it! Celebratory drink. <laughs> Fucking went to the bottom. Here's our first one. Okay, we are going to identify these later because I can't. Woo! White one and kind of like gray. There we go. This is what we just found. Uh, oh, there's one. Pretty. What? <gasps> All right, that's little. That's our next little seven. God, I'm getting tired. There's no more gemstones in here. Gemstones, rocks, or minerals. Um. Oh, I fucking say that, and then here's one. Alright. Cheers. Hey! It's pretty green. There we go. One more! So oh, tired of this rock. I mean, if I'm getting tired of bored of this, and this is like for kids eight and up, like Jesus Christ, like they would have given up long before me. We're gonna take a different approach to it, and I'm sure geologists do not do this, but let's just try it. Smaller. Oh my god. It is not in here. I do not see it at all. So the general consensus is there was a lot more rock than actual rock. Now it's time to actually do the hard part of identifying what we found. So this kind of looks pink and white. Or it's pink. So it's either sandstone or an or okay. So I think the easiest way we can fix this is to call my dad and identify these for us, right? Yes. FaceTime. Uh, please say hello to the camera for everyone. Hello, camera. This is my dad, the geologist. These were our little toy goggles. Safety first. Safety first. Told you. See, that's, that's the thing. You, sometimes you get exactly what you're wanting to find, and other times you find things you didn't even count on. 
there we go. That's what it's like to be a geologist, and I will definitely leave it to the professionals. So uh, I hope you like this video, and I will see you next week. Bye! Oh shit, okay.